Saturday, episode 5103. Uh, another day, another place, Blythe the Bling. You ever seen it? It's time. It's about this time. It's kind of late in the evening on Saturday, and um, it's smoky. You look it out there, and it looks um, like it's overcast, but it's hot, and it's uh, some kind of trick. It's a weird kind of what the. Hey, wait, wait a minute! What the jingle jangle trick is this kind of thing? That's the guy. <laughs> oh, hello, friends and neighbors! Welcome to another back of the program. Here we're on TV once again, once a day, every day. Turn on the machines and. For <sighs> here we go. I'm gonna have my all the way back around here to uh, whatever day this is here on uh, Saturday. Oh, there goes the Emperor's Palace car with the takeout Chinese food box on its roof. Yeah, it's hot out today. It's a weird thing. The smoky. There's wildfire somewhere, and the wildfires make it look cold, and then it's not cold. It's kind of like being car sick. As uh, let's see, um, uh oh, uh oh. I'm gonna find an old fork. Good thing I never throw anything away. I thought I had a fork somewhere. I thought I saw one and prepared it. Did I not? How am I going to eat my food? Looking around here. You see a fork? Yours? You didn't even point it out to me. There. There it is. Oh, here it is. I was sitting right on it. All right. Um. I got uh, pad thai, chicken pad thai with peanuts and lime, and uh, I made it here. But uh, yeah, it's smoky outside, so it's kind of like being it's like being car sick, kind of, because like uh, you see one thing and you feel another thing. Oh, what's going on? So it should be the thing you feel and the thing you see. They should be kind of matching. But, uh, you know, if you're, if you look out and then it's like cloudy and looks overcast, but then it's hot out, it's like, what the heck is going on with this whole thing? And then, same way, if it's car, if you're in a car and you're looking at like a book or a non-moving thing, and your eyes are saying, hey, we're staying still, even though, you know, you can tell in your brain, you can tell your brain that you're moving, but your brain and your your eyes, they don't play together very well. Even though I think your brain is maybe part of your eyes, like like your eyes is an extension of your brain. But I mean, where do you draw the line? But if you ever have like a brain in a jar, it's not uncommon for the brain in the jar to have eyes. And if that's anything to base off reality off of, then I don't know what else is. But uh, even though, even though your brain and your eyes, maybe it's because they're so connected that it is jarring to your stomach. Oh, I feel kind of sick. My brain, my brain and my eyes, they're not communicating well together. It's making me sick to my stomach. Huh? So, it's all, in, it's all up in there. Okay, Trying to catch up you. It's not, not great. Not the best. But it's fine. It's kind of not too good. But what is? Um. Went to the Thai truck up there on the west side for sour noodles with lime. Um. Yeah, it's good. It tastes fine. I don't know if it's like, mmm, but what is? Um, I 
I'm alive. Did you know? Did you know? Yesterday I was here. Um. Um. Let's see. Friday. Today's Friday, Saturday. It says Friday. You know what time works? And, uh. Yesterday. You know, working on a Friday. Got out of work, came down here. I saw a movie called The Conversation with Gene Hackman, directed by Francis Ford Coppola. Um, I had never seen it before. I guess it was his follow-up to The Godfather. It was artsy and... <laughs> Gene Hackman plays jazz, jazz sax. Do 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 do, do do ba ba, do 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 ba do do. You ever watch the uh, conversation workup? There's a guy that's been calling in and leaving messages with jazz trumpet on there. Um, the Miles Davis and um. Who's the saxophone guy now? I can't remember. Miles Davis is the is the, uh, the trumpet guy, and uh, Elliot, Elliot Duke Elliot. I don't remember that famous jazz saxophone guy. I think that uh, what's his name? Armstrong. Armstrong and. Miles Davis were from different eras, but, uh, what about, um, Miles Davis and, hmm, what the, the jazz sax guy is, um, they're, whatever they're doing, did they ever com collaborate? in a jazzy kind of way or it'd be too much jazz oh man there's a lot of jazz I don't know if I can follow all this jazz that was a movie with Gene Hackman playing the saxophone with Duke Remington um and the movie was okay it wasn't my favorite it's from the 70s it was from Francis Ford Coppola I have the guy that was Sonny, played Sonny in The Godfather. Um, ate the popcorn there. I actually ate <laughs> a whole lot. I had eaten that, um, the, the, the torta here while I was talking, I think, Kiara for a long time yesterday. And I ate that whole torta. And um, after that, I uh, went over and ate a large popcorn. So I was kind of like, wow. Stuffed. I was kind of stuffed. But it was fine. Stuffed with tortas. Stuffed with popcorn. Went home sleeping. Today, the Daiso opened over there in Lacey. Um, you ever been to Daiso? It's uh, kind of like an everything kind of store. They got it's like a dollar store. It's a dollar store, but um, it's uh, I mean everything's like a dollar seventy-five and more or more. But they have lots of things um for cheap prices, and it's neon pink. Their color is neon pink. So you can go buy Daiso. Um, the, for the first hundred people, they uh, were giving out free gift bags for people that spent more than $30. And I didn't make it. I thought I was going to make it. I didn't really try to get in there in a hurry or anything. Um, 
But I heard people were there since 6 a.m. Um, I got there around 11. Um, I didn't get the gift bag, but I did um, just go in there and buy stuff, and it's going to be open there tomorrow. They're doing the gift bags again tomorrow, but I don't think I'm going to go back because I already spent the money. Uh, but Daiso, uh, it's been only in Seattle and I'm up in California and Tequila and Federal Way. But it's always been somewhat of a kind of fancy place to me. I mean, now they just have it in the in the Fred Meyer um, strip mall in Lacey. So not even like at the mall area. So it was a pretty funny place to have it, but there was a lot of people there. And I mean, they're selling a lot of stuff. I've never seen so many people excited to buy. Like, just at a store, at a retail store. But there was like a... So... The first 100 people to spend more than $30 got a gift bag. And they sold all the gift bags before I got there, and there was still a line like around the block. So even if it was just those first 30 people, that's a... Uh, Three thousand dollars. Well, not that much for a whole store, but uh, I mean that's on grand opening the first few days that they're there. Now I'm gonna be able to go there all the time. It's kind of a weird thing. Um, it was one of the last places where I had to go all the way out to uh, to Seattle or basically to Aquila to go to Daiso. And now it's in my backyard. Um, feels good when it's there. Now it's slightly less of a uh, uh, antiquity. So it's like a thing that I don't get to do very much now. I can just go there whenever I want. It's open every single day, seven days a week. So now I'm like, hey, do I, if I need anything, do I want anything? Um, I can just go there. Plates, forks, you know, <laughs> spoons. Uh, um, they got band-aids, they got, um, knickknacks, masks, gloves, sunglasses, um, stickers, crafting stuff, pens, it's just all that stuff, so I never need to go anywhere ever again, and it's a weird feeling. I'm like, oh, I thought I had to go to several places, but no longer... Now I can go there. But they don't they don't have regular shoes, but they do have flip flops. I got I just got some flip flops. So that's good. But not not a uh, hmm. But didn't make it in time for the I'm losing track of what I'm saying. I didn't make it in time for the gift bag. But I did make it in time for the store. But not going tomorrow. Already spending my money. I don't need the gift bag. And who knows when I'm going to go back because I have so much stuff. I didn't need any stuff I got today, but I got it anyway. It's extra. Well, today, I'm like driving around, living, um, I'm going to see who's out there, what are we going to do today on Saturday, got some messages, let's see, oh, yeah, Mr. Ginsu, lots of messages, yellow fellow, oh, and some other people too, I don't know who they are. 
Well, that's a Mr. Ginson yellow phone messages, though. We will listen to them. Um, yeah, I'm just going to start listening to Mr. Ginson messages during couch time mess because I'm behind. I'm way behind on them. Oh, and like the back, the past, recent past also. People have been on the phones a lot. Um, yeah. I don't know, the movie was not that great. What's it called? The Conversation from the 70s. Like, hey, you ever gonna go to the 70s before? Um, because if you've been in the 70s, you might want to see this movie. Yeah, I, I ate a hoagie not too long ago. Um, so now I'm eating this, this kind of fancy food as well. I don't need to be eating here, but I, I you know, I want to eat on the, while I'm on TV. Otherwise, what am I doing? So, um, it's hard to hard to navigate that kind of thing. Um, yeah, weekend. I'm like only one one day, and then I'm gonna be doing a bunch of stuff tomorrow. Um, well, tomorrow's Sunday, but then on the week I'm gonna go to the fair, which I did find out that my sweater made it into the state fair. So we'll go up there and get a picture and see um, if they if 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 it made it in there. If I'm going to be a award winner or otherwise, I think I'm probably not because it's not technically very sound. Um, so we'll see. We'll see though. And it's made out of Walmart yarn. We'll see if it works though. I don't know why they're playing that movie. I guess it's because maybe the 4K restoration. Hey, it's a 4K restoration of a movie you don't know about. There's reasons people don't know about it, maybe. Um, after The Godfather. But I guess I don't even know what else did he that guy make. A uh, 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 Dracula with uh, Bram Stoker's Dracula, I think. Yeah. All right, ding a ding a ding. Where's this thing? I'm watching it go. And we'll listen to these Mr. Ginsu messages, or we should start off with these yellow fellow messages. After the thing dings. Um, yeah, there was, uh, I had been going all the way out to Lakewood, and before that to Tequila. Um, Lakewood. So, um, it's gonna be a little bit before he gets on the thing. Um, didn't get he didn't get the thing because I was there. He wasn't there, and he was working. And he woke up really early for it. The guy told me that there was people there from 6 a.m. 6 a.m. through. I mean, whatever. They're there for hours, and the place didn't even open until nine, so people were waiting a long time. Oh. Uh, what's going on with the phones? Connect. 
Come on. I don't know why it's not connecting. Is it broken? Andrew! Oh, hello? Oh! Hello, can you hear me? Oh, yeah? Yeah? Hello, can you hear me? Fuck, 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 fuck. Can you hear me? Fuck, 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 fuck. What are you doing that for? Can you hear me? Yeah? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah. What are you doing? Can you hear me? I can hear you now. Okay. How are you? Good, are you? Good. Did you go to Daiso? No. No, you're going to go? They're probably open right now. I tried to go, but there's a line out the door, so I didn't go. When? Because three hours ago. Yeah, you stopped by there, but it was still, it was, it's still all the way out the door at like four, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I went there. I waited in that line. How long did it take? Like an hour. <laughs> <laughs> People wait. Really, they want to shop. Can I do it again? Sure. What time do they close? I don't know. I would go back. I already went there once, but I'll go there again. Mm -hmm. uh, I think they might close at 9 o'clock. I started mm -hmm. this at 6.30. I have about 35 minutes left. I could go. Uh, we could go back. Um, mm -hmm. go back. I already got... I'm not going to buy anything else, though. I shouldn't buy... Or, or maybe I will. I don't know. But, uh... What did you buy? Well, buy already. Well, what did you buy? What did I buy? Oh, I bought some more sunglasses and masks. Mm -hmm. You see it on the wall? You see those masks on the wall? No. I'll go look in the hallway. All right. All right, you see, and then there's masks in the hallway, like scary masks, and I got um more sunglasses, even though I'm buried up in the neck in sunglasses. And oh, yeah. I also got, um, what, snacks and, um, sandal or like, yeah, flip-flops and, uh, I don't know, other garbage. 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 Lots of money on garbage and then... And you get snacks? Just keep on going back. What? Snacks. Sway? Snacks. Sway? Snacks. What's sway? Snacks. Snacks? Yeah. I got chips and sembe and a, a drink called sweat, the sweat drink, you know? You got that? It tastes like? It tastes kind of like, Gator like Gatorade. You taste like sweat? The Gatorade kind of tastes like sweat. That's why, you know when they sweat, like in the Gatorade commercials, when they're sweating, Gatorade? Yeah. And that's like, doesn't seem like a very good marketing ploy, but that's maybe they're like, oh, it's sweat, you want to drink sweat? That's why they sell it as sweat. The Japanese people got confused from the Gatorade commercials. Could be. But, uh, you know, you sweat it out, and then you drink your own sweat. So after you're sweating, then you drink sweat, and then it's, you have more sweat to sweat after that. You know? Uh -huh. Um, yeah, it was a line out the door. First hundred people got the gift bag, but I didn't I didn't get there in time. What was it? What was the gift bag? Yeah. Like stuffed animals, random Daiso stuff. Uh -huh. Um I went up there and uh they like there was the it was like the surprise gift bag for people. And they were still giving them out when I was there, but I, I didn't know I knew I wasn't gonna make it in the line, and so I asked the person giving out the bags if I could look in there, and then they said no, <laughs> and then I said no. 
I, and then I said, come on, come on. And then they let me. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And what? No, why not? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna take him. I'm not gonna make it in here. Just let me see it. I just want to see what I'm missing out on. And then they're like, I don't know. And then I'm like, yeah, I, I know. Just do it. Just do it. Just let me do it. You know? Mm-hmm. And then they did. Um, so I looked at it and it was just random Daiso stuff. Who would have thought? And yeah. a canvas bag. Canvas bag. But they're doing it tomorrow. But I'm not going to go back tomorrow because I already spent a bunch of money there and you got to buy $30 worth of stuff to get the prize. You do? Yeah. Wow. And I already bought too much. I already bought too much, so if I didn't go today, but um, I'm going to go back, or I'm not going to go back, I guess I'll go back tonight, but I wasn't going to go back for a while, but I can go back anyway. Um, I don't need to go back there. I didn't even need to buy anything when I went there, you know? Like, what? Yeah. I, and then I just went in there anyway and bought a bunch of stuff. Um, not like I needed extra stuff, but now, never go to the dollar store ever again. Yeah, yeah you never need to go to the dollar store. Yeah. Yeah. What, what what do I buy from the dollar store? Bottles. Uh, uh Scissors. They got. Uh, vo- they have voodoo chips, I guess. Yeah, they don't have voodoo chips there, but voodoo chips are make me sick. <coughs> like uh-huh. they're good. They taste good. I want to eat them, but they make me actually sick when I eat them. I'm like, oh my god, I'm sick. Yeah, but they're good. They taste good. But, like, wow, the pain is pretty bad. Like, I mean, last time, remember last time when I, I don't know if it was a combination of, of that and other things, but I was, like, had, I was, like, actually sick. I was, like, um, not, I was not well. I was, like, laying down and then, like, oh, man. Remember that? Well, it happened. I got, I was incapacitatedly sick. Yeah, there's just like lots and lots of vinegar. I think it's just too much vinegar, maybe. Well, I have it. But it tastes good. They taste better and they make you more sick than regular chips. Yes. Um, yeah. Uh, Daiso, you gonna go? You wanna go after I get out of work? Or not out of work, sure. out, of, out of the program? <laughs> Out of the work, out of the program. I'm going to go to Daiso again? Yeah. All right, go at night. Hey, what you here in the daytime? Yep, I'm back at night. Yeah, good, bye. Bye. Who cares? Who cares? I check my bank now. by Codependency Anonymous. Bye, Future. Bye. Hello? 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 Oh, hi. Hi. Hi, this is Tracy from what? And I'm calling to say that yesterday, after work, from the place where I work in Vancouver, BC, Canada. I got into my van and I drove past Bellas Fair, well, past the Peace Arch, past yeah. Bellas Fair, wow. past the Space Needle, mm-hmm. and then I drove past the Tacoma Dome. Wow. And now I'm at a lake 
in Olympia, Washington. Oh my gosh. And I'll be at the festival called Northern Sky. Wow. And I was wondering if you would be there as well. No. Or if, um, if, uh, if you're doing okay. I'm doing okay. So, um, yeah, I hope you're doing well. And, um, maybe I'll see you around this weekend. Oh, yeah? Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, you're probably at this festival right now. But, uh, I guess we'll call anyway. What happens when you call people in the middle of them doing things? Uh, okay, my phone's ringing, or how often people's phones ring. That my phone number is 6420220. That my phone is usually. Uh -huh. So I probably won't answer that. Um, if you'd like to. I am. Goodbye. Well, you reached Tracy's voicemail. Um, I would say leave a detailed message, but you can also just text me. Okay, thanks. Bye. Uh, hey, 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 Please leave your message after the tone. Hello, Tracy. It's the program. Is your phone off? You drove all the way down here. I'm not going to be at that festival, but that sounds like a good festival. I did hear about it. Um, lots of things are happening. Oh, what the? Oh, Kiara. Hi, Hi, Kiara. How are you? I'm pretty good. Um, I just found out that Zoe's in Vegas. Oh, yeah? You, you rekindled? No. Oh. I'm not able to. I'm blocked. Oh, well, how'd you find out then? Because, um, uh, I still, I follow her friend, um, who's her ex's, uh, friend, and we used to hang out, and now she, uh, he posts because of, uh, wait a minute. Yeah? Wait a minute. Okay. Right, we're leaving a message for Tracy. I'm sorry, Kenny, what did you say? I had a rehab thing. We're leaving a voicemail for Tracy also. Oh, cool. Hi, Tracy. Um, you had a rehab thing? Yeah, he just knocked on my door asking, um, I want to be driven to this meeting. I'm going to go to this meeting so I can talk about being afraid that Zoe's going to die in Vegas. They knocked on your door and they said, Don't drink! Yeah. <laughs> you think she's I'm not going to. My hands are in the air so I can't drink. Yeah, you think she's going to die in, from drinking? or? Yes. Well, from running into a car. She's... Uh, she used to, like, like, when, when she gets super strong, she'd rent scooters and go as fast down the hills as possible and do shit like that. And one day, it's not going to work out. And I've been praying. And I don't even believe in God. Yeah, all right. But that's not, I mean, that's the same thing that you were doing, right? And now you're thinking it's not a good idea? I, uh, I wasn't, I wasn't doing the scooter thing. I was just sitting and, um... Sitting and writing, and the writing didn't make any sense. Oh, she's blasting down the hills on the scooter? Yeah. Oh, that's dangerous. Which is so much cooler to do when you're drunk than much more fun than writing, trust me. Yeah. Um, Probably, yeah. I don't know. Vegas is made for that. I think you'd be more safe getting wasted in Vegas than most places. Is that is that true? I, I guess so. Yeah, I guess there's a bunch of other people. There's a bunch of other people, and they're all... The whole place is built to get wasted yeah. and get your money, so they're trying to take care of you. Yeah, the thing is... The your time is about to expire. Huh? Please finish your message within eight seconds. We have to finish our message within eight seconds. Oh, gosh. Um... I, I, I really don't know what I'm supposed to say to this person. Your recording time has expired. To send this message now, press oh, no, I'm sorry. To I'm, really I'm hanging it up. I'm hanging it up. We left the message. 
Hey, what a good message. Good that was a good message. Tracy from Canada is in a, in town for a festival, but didn't show up here. But said that, oh. but but uh, Tracy told me that it's like, hey, I'm coming to town, but uh, you could call them anytime. But people will only call me when they're here in town, but then they're on the phone. That's interesting. Did people who show up in person not usually call you on the show? It's it's up and down. Tracy's in a band. Whoa. Oh, is it the KMDF band or whatever? It's not that band. It's they're, they're called What. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Yeah, What. The band's name What. I think I had like I think I, I think some of my friends wanted to start a band called What before with me. It's a good name, kinda. It's a good name. It's a classic. It's confusing. It's a little confusing. I guess it's better than what band. What's on next? What? Uh, I don't want it. That whole thing confuses me, Kenny. I can't get through that. Um. Okay. Well, you you're you're like, I mean, cyber is it cyber stalking, Zoe? If you know where she's doing. I'm not cyber stalking. I follow Jaime because um I I followed him. Before, because sometimes we'd all hang out together, and, like, she kind of, like, secretly hated him, because he, uh, he's not really that fun when, before drinking, but when drinking, it's, he's, he's, like, just, uh, not really, not really there. I think the main issue that she has with him is that he plays a lot of, like, um, like 2010's pop hits. That's like the music he listens to. Oh my god, like what? Like Imagine Dragons. No! Like, um, uh, what's that? What's that one song? There's one song that really sums up um, what he listens to. Do you know that fucking um, like Halsey? Like, but it's usually it's it's usually the stuff that you don't always... Oh, the airplanes. The airplane song. That type of thing. I don't know what song that... Oh, like, like the G6? No, no, the airplanes and the night sky. Like Nicki Minaj? No, no. It's... Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll play Nicki Minaj, but usually it's more poppy than that. It's more like the... Like the, um... Like the stomp clap stuff. Uh, like the, yo, know, that, like, weird folky garbage? Yes! Yes, the Lumineers! No, that's, that's bad. Yeah, it's, uh, I feel bad for, that's one of the reasons I'm scared is because in order to put up with that music, you have to keep drinking more and more. <laughs> but I guess you're right. But I guess there's a cushion. Can't you... I really don't have that much to do except worry and obsess over things. Yeah, don't you have, a, like, a say over the DJ? Whatever it means, DJ'd? What DJ? Like, when this guy's playing his bad music, you can't DJ? You can't take mm-hmm. the... DJ. Like, why is, why is that guy the DJ? Yeah, he always gets ox. I, I think because he always has the speaker. It's he usually brings the speaker, but... Oh. I don't know. If she gets the speaker, then that issue will go away last night. Yeah. But he's just... He's not really, um... He's not too much of a conversationalist, but sometimes he can be funny. But now he's in the... So I like him, but I don't... Maybe I should unfollow him so I don't see his post because I know that that's part of the reason that they're being posted because... I don't know. I need to stop because um, my head. This is why I'm in the codependency groups, and uh, yeah, they tell you to not be to not be obsessive. Have you ever been to um? Hey, don't be obsessive. That's a good advice. Yes. Don't be obsessive. You ever been to Vegas? <laughs> you know what? I don't think I've ever been to Vegas. No. Yeah, I've been there. Um, when I was like 12. Oh, really? Did you like it? <laughs> it was a good time when I was 12. We went to the M&M store. Oh, 
Oh yeah, they have the M and M store. Did you get to um, go to the arcades that they have for kids? Yeah, arcades, and I did a little bit of gambling. Ooh, you got to gamble? Yeah, I ran in there. Wow, did you win anything? I ran in there and played the slots. I don't remember winning anything. You'd probably be good at gambling. You want to be a gambler, right? I like gambling. I, I gamble probably, I mean, I don't gamble very much, but still too much. It could probably ruin your life if you keep going. Yeah, I'm pretty, I, I don't gamble that much, but I, I do like to do it. There's a casino that's pretty close to here. Um, yeah, I guess you're too young for the casino still. Have, or Are you 21? You're not. You're only 20, right? Yeah, I'm still 20. You got to be 21 to go to the casino. Yeah, I think I think so, but that's an issue. Is that if I if I gamble, I'm going to become addicted to gambling, so I can't gamble. Uh, yeah, um, I mean, are you addicted to everything? I'm a very I have a very very addicted personality. I used to be addicted to kratom after I tried it. I was addicted to ketamine when I tried it. I was I, I'm addicted to anything I try. I'm addicted to any art that I start. I'm addicted to everything, Kenny. Oh, that's good. It's good for <laughs> good for me. You've been calling here. I can't stop. Um, but uh, uh, can't stop. One stop. Yeah, that's that's probably fine. But look out, yeah, look out for gambling. Gambling's very addictive. Um, but I went there. But uh, yeah, I guess you're not gonna gamble. Is there casinos? Do they got casinos in in what uh, the area of Sacramento or something? There's so many, like, little gamblings. Oh, in Sacramento? In Sacramento, there's Cash Creek Casino, and um, there we just found a Hard Rock Casino. Hard yeah. Rock ca Cafe Casino, Are they run seems by natives? glamorous to me. Are they run by natives? Um, Are they run by natives? Um, yeah, I, I, I think so. I think so, but I didn't know Hard Rock Cafe was. Around here, all the big casinos are on the reservations. Yeah, no, we have... I, I don't know if they're on reservations, because some of them now are, like, more so in, like, inside of Sacramento. But um, here in Portland, there's a bunch of little gambling places, and it says, like, like arcade something... And they're gambling places, and I've looked inside them, and it looks, like, really depressing in those places. Yeah, they have little government-run, like, lo it's like lotto rooms or something, basically. Yeah. Yeah, it's run by the government. You know, the government runs the lotto and scratch cards. Oh, that's really fucked up. Yeah. Um, what do they call that? There's a term for that type of thing. Yeah. The Scion. The Scion. A Scion. What's that? I don't know. You tell me. Oh. Have you have you ever been to Daiso? Daiso. I love Daiso. is my favorite store. I get everything at Daiso. I get my snacks at Daiso. No, I don't. I've been to Daiso, but I don't. I haven't gone in a long time. You know, I'm one in Portland. I don't know if they have one in Portland. They probably do. Um, I, like, usually when I'm going out, it's just to go to meetings. Today I walked around to the, um, to the Comic-Con to people watch, and I was going to sneak in, but then I got lost in the parking garage, and then I got tired, and my phone was almost dead. So I don't... I don't really explore much. Um, Did you see I'm, Mario? Oh, let's see if there's a Daiso. I should do a Daiso trip. Did you see Mario? You know, oh my god, I saw no Marios. I what? saw a bunch of anime people, but I didn't see anybody as Mario. Yeah, uh, you like that stuff? No. I don't either. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of that stuff. Good but, answer. Um, I like things that people like and that, like, sure. I can people watch. But, um, yeah, I'm not really, I'm not really into that stuff. But yeah. whenever there's anything to do, I'll do it if I can get in. Yeah, yeah, we do it for fun. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't care for that kind of thing. Um, also, it's kind of cool, yeah, cultural appropriation, I think, with the anime. 
You think it's cultural appropriation? Yeah, with the with the Japanese stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 Well, if it's like misogynistic, then is it okay to um, appropriate it because it's already bad? No. Okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Wait, but is, isn't Mario Japanese? Yeah, Mario's Japanese, but uh, I guess it. <laughs> I guess it's like less specifically Japanese than other things that are Japanese. Yeah, you don't like when, <laughs> you don't love it when people dress up like um, like Japanese characters. When my people dress up as Japanese characters. No, I don't like that. And um, they they're obsessed with <laughs> Japanese, and they they like Japanese stuff more than Japanese people. Yeah, and they um, they consider the anime as like its own thing. Yeah. Um, but that's not, I guess it's kind of Daiso's in, is it got anime stuff there, but, um, they just opened one in Lacey, which is the next town over, and they're, it's actually on Slater Kenny Road. Oh my god, I need to go. It was the, uh, it's the first oh, one, the lot, the, Daiso was about, it took about an hour to get to in a car, and now there's one in Lacey, so I can go there all the time. Don't they have your cheap sunglasses? They do. I got so many sunglasses. Oh, yeah. Kenny, I have to go because I need to go to a meeting. Bye-bye. Bye. Oh, I'm full. All right. We'll call Yellow Fellow, even though it's kind of late. I don't know if he's going to answer. I'm going to call Mr. Ginsu. Making the calls. Bong, bong, bong. The previous subscriber you have called is not available. Please send a message after the tone. Yellow Fellow, it's the program. How are you? Where are you? You can call us back. You have about, uh... Oh, man, you only have about 12 minutes left today. Um... Oh, uh, I didn't get kind of mess of the future. I kind of want to look at these okay. from the recent ones, because it's going to be a while. Maybe we'll look at them next year. Take for a walk. Fucking a mile down the road, two mile down the road, whenever you get home. You might drink your little milk. <laughs> might drink your little milk. Here to run. Here to running. Here to moving around, doing stuff. Sitting on a swing. Yeah, just because he... Alright, Mr. Gensu, what are you saying? This is, he only left one message today. Oh, what's it gonna be? some of the effects here. Fuck off. NWPC. Dot org, I guess. Uh, DW of the news, whatever, I don't know. Fuck it. Talk about some little girl over in Europe, I believe. I'm not totally positive. You won't eat solid food. There's a child 
but is not active. Okay? Uh-huh. Take that little girl out. Take her for a walk, fucking a mile down the road, two miles down the road. Whenever you get home, you might drink your little milk. <laughs> get her to run. Get her running. Get her moving around, doing stuff. Yeah. Sitting on a swing. Yeah, just because she's moving while she's sitting on a swing is not activity. Okay? You need to make that little girl active. Hold her hand and walk her ass or help jog her down the fucking road. Help jog her. And she will gain an appetite. There she is, sitting on her fucking ass again. Who? Fuck. What the fuck? Okay, so she got down on the floor, and then now she's sitting on her ass again. Oh, she got a little fucking robot, fucking uh, dinosaur. The dinosaur dances around, the little girl sits on the couch. Fuck off! Get the hell out, girl. Pick her ass up. Run her down the road. Oh, there she goes. She's walking now. What are you she's talking about? Walking. Maybe I'm wrong. She actually can run a half a mile an hour. Um, hey, lady, don't pick her up and do that. Let her keep running on her fucking ass own. Fuck, she went, she ran, well, she kind of ran, jog, like 20 feet, and her mom picked her up, swinging her in the air, swinging her around. Fuck off. Fuck, what'd she do? She ran 20 feet. How about you fucking let her go 500 feet before you pick her up and swing her around? Not 20 fucking feet. Fuck. Who is this? I got nothing now. I think she's spoiled. Is the, the pee -pee? Mr. Ginsu. Hello. Uh-oh. Oh, you talking? I can barely hear you. your phone's weird. <laughs> What? Who's this kid that you're talking about in the message? I'm not sure. Yeah, you're not sure who you're talking about? You said that some kid's being lazy and you're trying to swing him around? Well, I think Yeah. Phone is messed up. I'm, I'm getting about half of what you're saying. <laughs> oh, I heard that. I don't know what's going on with the phone. It, gee, maybe you should check your phone settings. Well, you just got an Android phone, like a cheap, cheap Android phone? I've never heard anybody's phone be as bad as your phone. I've never run into a phone that's this bad consistently, and I, I am on the phone a lot. I don't know, maybe it's because you're where you're at, but uh, yeah, it's pretty wild sometimes. But I, I can hear your messages, but I've been, been running them through audio manipulation sometimes so I can hear them better. I see you, man. You can do that. Yeah, it's some detective stuff. I don't know. 
But you don't know who you were talking about? You said some kid was lazy and they're swinging him around when they should be letting him exercise. You don't know who it is? No, I have no clue. You don't remember the message from this morning? Uh, I remember the message, but I just don't know who it is. Where did you even see this kid? Uh, well, I see the kid in the what, you saw them on TV? Yeah, come on. It's a TV kid. Lazy TV kid. Get it together, you lazy TV kid. I was just saying, let's turn around. Yeah. Um, the show is almost over. We only have about th- uh, four minutes left, three minutes left. They opened Daiso. They opened Daiso and Lacey today. Um, they just black food and we don't like this blunt. You, you're gonna light a blunt? Yep, I'm gonna. Wow, that's expensive. Yeah. That's fancy. You got a swisher? Sweet. Yep. No, you got something else? No, I got something else. Too. Smoke on the blunt. That's, fa- that's fancy. You're, you're fancy. Yep. <laughs> On the phone, and I just phone. Nobody else is on the phone. But uh, we have a lot of stuff to do. I'm going to record this message to the future, and the show's almost over anyway. But did I do this yet? Hey, future. It's us. The past. Did you still go to Dyson? Are they still there? Yeah. Yeah. Grand opening, back future. Yeah, grand opening, back Yeah. Time to sleep? You say you need time to sleep? Yeah, yeah, I do. I'm getting real tired. Yeah, maybe it's, I think it might be the Red Bulls. No, I'm, I had a drink of it. The Red Bulls are going to mess with your energy levels and all together. No, I don't know how long it's just like you said. Yeah, you haven't had one all day. That'll be doing it. No, uh, yeah, I've had four or five. Four or five Red Bulls? Yeah, that, I mean, eventually yeah. that'll mess you up. It could do the other doing the opposite. Um... You know, you did. <laughs> How'd your frozen one go? Oh, uh, that was horrible. I, I did end up drinking as much of it about 45 minutes later than I thought out. Yeah, well, the show's over. Thank you. What's up, baby? Oh, we gotta do the credits. Thanks for watching. Yeah, we gotta do these credits. It's Saturday. We're on TCTV, channel 22, 11.30 and 2 a.m.
Why are you showing me I'm on YouTube? 360 or 360 calling messaging on TV, yeah. Why did you show me on .com? Yeah. Faulty Friday is a good song, thank you. TCTV, LaBebe, Dirty Fabulous, Circle Books, 4 Video. Yeah. Sauce by a Con, Rebecca, yeah. Mount Morton, North Westchester County, Washington State, USA. Thank you, and viewers, you're watching, thank you. Hey, John, where are you? Call me. Yeah, yeah dog. Bye. 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 Bye.